Hey, what's up guys? How are you guys doing today? Today we will be reacting to Skadoosh. Huge fight breaks out. This is another Nick Breezy video. If you guys want, go subscribe to him. You know, he's always putting out some fire, uh, 5v5 street ball collaboration. But today it looks like a huge fight breaks out. And this never happens in his video, bro. They never fight. So this is kind of crazy to see. But let's see what happens. Let's see if we get some good b-ball going on. Let's see what's up. Thank you for coming out for the video. And yeah. Oh damn, that's a disrespect stepping over him like that. <laughs> oh shit. <gasps> what happened to that kid? Boom. Money. Gah! Oh, he snuck him bad. Holy shit. Showed you guys a 15 game parlay. My boy. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not sponsored by them, so. My dad got me an Uber here. This is a fratty crowd. We got some Gymshark t-shirts, so you know, dude. The roids are flowing in the crowd. Damn, that was sad. Money. What is it? I feel like this video could be higher. Oh, 160. Shit. Okay. Let's go. Every frat means like a funny black guy. It's like a rule, I'm pretty sure. Wow, this is a really intense game, dude. No wonder they end up fighting, bro. Everyone's mad they can't make shit. Who's that? This guy's annoying. I thought he was wearing like a Mariner jersey, but it, it looks like... Airball, man. Fuck. That's embarrassing. Don't even come to the court if you're going to be wide open and airball like that, dog. Disrespecting him like that. Okay. No pull up. Pass it out. Yep. Nothing. Oh my god, dude. That is some bitch shit walking over him like that. Over nothing. After night, uh huh. God, dude, I would be so more like, fuck you, motherfucker, don't touch me. Yam it? Wow, he really missed that. Light work! 
Kind of looks like he was off of Zan, too. Damn. Big dummy? Man, dude, the team that they're playing is fucking shit. Chancey's showing up. Chauncey. Man, dude. His ego got him a little bit there. He didn't know what to say, dude. He didn't know what to say with a grown man talking to him like that. That was a good hoop. Cut, baby. Damn, got the slaps. So mid. I'm like breezy talking shit, and did he make it? Okay, okay, they're getting some momentum. Shouting, uh oh, the shirt removal. Uh oh, randomly, another man has as big as him has showed up, puffing out his chest. Oh, god, you better hope they've brushed their teeth because they're really close to each other. I'll turn up a little. They probably stinky. That weird shoulder shrug. I'm a KO your ass. Oh. Oh, they got the OGs on them or something? People are so stupid that wear fucking wife beaters on their shit. Is that a culture thing? Should I not have said that? It's a Mexican thing too. Fuck yeah, I can say that. I don't like seeing old people get knocked out though. Oh, 
Wait, 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 wait. Did this guy just get dropped? What just fucking happened out of nowhere? Did air punch him? What the f Okay, that's a little too far. The OGs really turn up the heat. See, the disrespect starts happening when, like, you start... You know, people don't like when you get their fingers close to their eyes, you know? It's like a self-defense, you know? You don't want an eye to get jabbed out. This guy's staring at his dick. You see this, homie? Look at him. That is direct eye contact with OG's dick. Hey, yo, Sigma Kai, you guys got to check this guy out. He, uh... It's okay being gay in a fraternity, but, like, maybe this not is not the right time to check out a man's genitalia. That was the moment. Boom. Holy shit. I think Chauncey, look at him, bro. His fist. I think Chauncey, look at this homie. This homie got fucking rocked. You could tell all these homies aren't about fighting either, dude, because look at this shit. They're all like, oh, fuck. Shit started going down. This homie has a rose fucking gold uh, Apple Watch. You could see that right here. He's definitely not about to fight fucking anyone, dude. This guy, he, hmm. I'm trying to be nice. Never mind. That kid got fucking rocked, though, by Chauncey. I'm pretty sure. Anthony Davis in the mix. Damn, that homie's leaking. Wasn't good contact, wasn't a good punch either. You see that guy run away? Oh my god, dude. That kid was, he was so fucking scared of what was about to happen to him because he knew he was about to get fucked up. It was some guy with a chain. Oh, right here? Look at, boom. Watch his getaway. He's so scared he runs <laughs> He ran off, dude. Now they're just headhunting. Now it's just time to scrap. People are bold that just stand right there, dude. In the way of fucking fisticuffs being thrown. He didn't get slept, dude. You better sleep a motherfucker if you fucking... If you sneak him like that, you better sleep, you better sleep him. That's some bitch shit. Like this guy with the bloody mouth, he got snuck, but he got rocked. The classic defense mechanism is... He wants to fight, but someone's holding him back. And you can obviously tell he's really not trying to um, get away from the guy holding him back. But he's still trying to act like he wants to fight. The big guy was pushing their homie, though. I don't think the guy at the bloody ha mouth really did anything. I don't think he deserved to get fucking punched. But at the same time, when you're acting like someone that puffs out their chest and is fucking tough, one day, there will be someone... That is willing to test you on how tough you are and test their fucking toughness. So they're going to fucking be down to throw fisticuffs with you. It's just, it's like the fucking, I don't know, I want to say like animal structure, but I don't even think that's a fucking thing. It's just like our primal instincts, you know? Like, every now and then, if you want to go out and act like you're tough, 
there's going to be another guy also going out and acting like he's fucking tough. And one day you're going to meet your maker because, you know, there's a reason why uh, there's uh, weight divisions. Not every fight is fair. He kind of seems drunk too, but his, I think his bell is just wrong. Aw, oh, rip Chipotle, well. Doesn't look like that dank of a bull, honestly. He doesn't have any of the peppers in it. Ugh. Hey, I'm really worried about paying for these stitches. My Chipotle too. That's probably only 15 bucks. I also don't care about none of this shit either. <laughs> what the fuck? I know why he punched him though. This guy's a punchable face though. What is this? What is the guy behind him having his mouth? What the fuck was that? Tie the score to 11 11. <laughs> These frat kids are fucking trash, though. And look at daylight's already gone, dude. They wasted all their time scrapping. They move really slow too, like they're not athletic. Who Carlos sings those? Oh, a little man got scared of the big man. No. That's a good dunk, dude. The gym shark were merch is running heavy in this uh this crowd. Ooh, a dangly earring. I was expecting to see a lot more of those. Sadly, it's the only Mexican guy. Yo, yo, what's up, everybody? Yo, yo, what's up, dude? Can oh, wait, here. What, can I do this? For a second, I thought I wasn't recording. Yo, yo, just kicking with my boy Dick Works, you know, up in this, up in this bitch. All right, guys, but thank you for watching. Please go subscribe to Nick Breeze's channel. This homie is always uploading good content. I guess a lot of these fights are probably fake and staged, you know, because this homie, uh, Nick Breeze, uh, look at that beard, dude. It's the beard of an evil genius. Oh, sorry. That's a beard of an evil genius, you know. <sighs> this guy can't be up to any good. But go like his videos. Go subscribe to me. Go subscribe to him. Thank you. Peace, love, and go hug your mother. See you guys next time. Wait, I didn't mean it like. What the hell? I did enjoy the video. See you next. See you, boys.